Finance officials say revenue collections for October fell short. We were about 25 percent less than projected. This spells trouble for the government's December payroll, though officials say they're doing everything to avoid a shutdown. Director Gottlieb and myself and the other members of the financial team, and not least of all, of course, the governor, have been working very hard for the last three, four years since the financial crisis began internationally to ensure exactly that we would not have a government shutdown. And there's no reason to suspect that at this point, after having Having worked this hard that we would allow such a thing to occur. Individual income tax collections was one of the major shortfalls. This year's was 40 percent less than last year's. Senators have introduced a bill they hope will provide a better way of projecting revenues to avoid this problem in the future. Bill 29-167 seeks to establish a revenue estimating conference. Executive and legislative officials will sit at the same table with economists and other outside experts to provide a better financial forecast. The governor's team says it would be duplicating efforts, and senators are split. I don't really support this because to establish a conference that meets on occasions, I don't think that's going to get it. I actually support this bill. We're ne not necessarily opposed to it, but we don't want to give the impression that there's something that would happen there that we don't do right now. For now, the government may have to dip into the insurance guarantee fund to meet December's payroll. We do feel that with the ability to tap the insurance guarantee fund that we will be able to make it through December. However, having said that, we look more than one month into the future and we do expect some challenging times in the remaining months of the fiscal year. Erica Parsons, News 2.